gonna finish this Christmas letter. Mm. you make of each of us, attracted to shiny objects and all. It's out of the long-standing love I have for you that I write. For all of our follow-la-las and deck the halls, well, a huge fan, of course, by the way, long-time admirer and supporter of every sleigh that is both one horse and open. <laughs> with every lovely side dish we've added, thankfully we've not yet overshadowed entirely the centerpiece around which the festive table is set, a long-awaited baby in an unexpected bed. Oh, high fives all around for that, well, yes, because that baby means something to even the Grinchiest Scrooge among us. The silent night brings peace to our noise. Those herald angels sing hope over our humdrum, that star it pierces our darkness. So, thank you for that. <sighs> oh, perhaps we pinned far too much to you already, but would you mind if I make one more request? With all our bells jingling and our snowmen frosty, would you promise me this Christmas, please? Don't compete with the cross. Because it, it might be tempting for us, you know. It might be a cinch for us to assume our carols and chimneys are the point. But to gaze so intently at the gingerbread houses that we can't focus on the Hebrew house of bread, also known as Little Town of Bethlehem. It could be tempting to settle for joy to the world and not to receive our king. Uh, I guess what I'm asking is, would you promise not to do it? This, this little baby here, oh yes. Would you promise not to give us a feeding trough without a rugged cross? It's the brutal beams and the borrowed tomb which made him Christ after all. And, it's not, and if not for Christ, then where exactly is your Mary anyway? Whatever you do, don't take the cross from men who need nothing more than its tidings of comfort and joy. <sighs> hey, thanks for everything. You really are worth keeping all year through. Hmm. Love, Martha. Oh, P.S. I'm dreaming super hard of a white Christmas down here, but I live in Warrington, Florida, for goodness sake. So if you could just work out something flaky, with the snow lies or Mrs. Claus, that would be great. Or whatever works, whatever works. Okay, let me see. Oh, one more thing. We forgive you for the fruitcake. <laughs>